hello guys and welcome back to my channel if you're new thank you so much for deciding to subscribe to my channel it means a lot to me now in today's video we are going to be talking about this alternative um this option um that you can use in, in place of a wig stand okay now i have talked about this thing in my affordable wig making starter kit for beginners a part two of it and i decided to show you guys how this thing looks when you just get it out of the package and how to set it up and how to use it so if this sounds fun or something that you think you're interested in then definitely um keep on watching okay now this is um how the whole thing looks like now it comes in four different um different pieces in the package now what you want to do is that this is the main um the main clamp so you want to um unscrew it make it loose and then fix this um how do you call it this um rubber thing here i think this rubber thing here make sure that you know the surface doesn't cause any form of friction or something like that so that is what this um rubber thing is for and yes you can see i'm trying to set it up and show you close-ups of it so that if you purchase it you can you know easily set yours up okay now the part that i show you is where you're going to attach to your flat you know flat surface and this is going to be at the top but before you put this um this part at the top you have to put that lever is it a lever yeah this is where you're going to insert it into the wick like the cup itself the mannequin head so this one goes inside okay this one goes inside and then the ball the ball part goes under okay so this is how it looks like this is what you're going to put into the hole that comes with the mannequin head okay and this is the top part so you're going to put that okay you see where i'm putting it you're going to put that inside and then you're going to you know manipulate it now i'm also going to show you how you can easily manipulate it and you know how you're going to fix it on the main clamp okay so you're going to put so the ball part is supposed to be at the top and then you're going to you know screw that part on the main clamp now what you want to notice is that um it depends if you want to make your wig tilt to a particular side that is how you are going to screw it if you want the screw to be very loose so that you can move the other part around then you're going to make it very very loose okay and if you want to have a very sh like balanced straight strong you know holder then you're going to make your screw very 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 you know going to fasten it really tightly then with that your stand the part that goes into the wake up is going to be very very steady like very very tight and secure and it's not going to move anywhere so that is basically how to set up your clamp or your mini wig stand if you want to move the part that goes into the wake up around very freely then you're not going to make that you know that cup very very tight you're going to make that very loose so depending on how you want to position your wick your mannequin head your block head that is how you are going to screw that i'm also going to show you how to fix it on your flat surface okay now if you have any flat surface like a table a chair anything that has a flat surface that can you know fit that kind of space you'd want to you know set that up there so this is a table i normally set this up now i'm going to put that they have to unscrew it and make sure that that space between the rubber part and the bottom part you know is enough to go there so this i'm going to show you you see the space there okay now if you want to make it tight if you want to know that it is tight and secure enough it's going to be very small so now look at how big that space is at the end of you know me screwing it and making it so tight you're going to notice that that part will become very very small now that's an indication that 
the clamp is securely you know fitted on whatever surface you're trying to put it on okay so you can see that the space between the rubber part and the surface is getting really really small do you, do you see that yes it's getting really small as compared to you know before we started this whole thing so you keep screwing screwing so it becomes secure extra firm yeah now the reason why the table is shaking is because it has very very um very very small and thin um legs it's a decorative piece so that's why it's you know it's moving around but if it were to be like a wooden structure then it wouldn't be shaking like that but then the clam or the mini stand or the mini tripod is securely fitted so you can see there is no extra space and this is how your clamp should be looking on your flat stuff is being it's a, cha a chair a table um whatever that you're trying to set that up now i'm also going to show you so you see how steady it is because of how the screw was i want to also demonstrate it to you so the moment i unscrewed it you can see how easy the pada goes into the mannequin or the style foam looks like it moves easily so yeah also put that at the back of your head if you want to tilt it unscrew it if you want to make it very very steady very very like strong then yeah so this is tightly fit i'm also going to show you this is my heaviest mannequin and i'm going to put that on top so this is the pada goes in yeah so this is my heaviest mannequin and you can see that it is steady as well now if you want to tilt like move it you see sometimes you, you can see pictures of you know wigs on mannequins that are tilted yeah if you want to do that you can easily do that and it's because it's fitted on a table you can easily like adjust it with the help of a table too okay so yeah that is basically that i use this particular mannequin to show you guys how strong um the mini um tripod can you know how strong the mini tripod also is so if you're on a budget then you should be looking at something like this and i'm not going to give a specific price because it depends on each vendor but i'm going to put in links in my description box so that you can you know try for yourself and this is this hair is from the headmistress luxury double john collection i'm also going to put this thing on a mannequin so that you guys can see what i'm talking about so most times you can see tilted wigs like this and sometimes it's just tilted to the left to the right yeah so that is basically it if you enjoy this short um, video demonstration don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and also share this video um this hair is available for sale either the hair you want to buy the hair or the wig itself you guys can see how beautiful this thing is i'll see you very soon in my next video bye guys